Today we continue our big blue blob run. Going to annex a ton of clay over here in Norway and hopefully, hopefully, hopefully get some claims on Sweden. Attack them, who is allied to England. Conquer as much land up here as humanly possible. These are all three dev provinces, which means they're going to be essentially free in the peace deal. So that should be good. Um, we are about to pick up like 13 provinces, I believe. And then um, whenever we attack these guys, we will not co-belligerent them, but I will piece these guys out separately and I will um, annul their alliances. So welcome back, everybody, to the Big Blue Blob. Thank you so much for the awesome reception in the first episode. I am very thankful for that. I was taking a look, however, and we do have some options here of things we can do. Uh, now, if I get 30 dev provinces, I will or a 30 dev province, rather, I will get some extra splendor. I was looking over here at Paris, and uh, I think it is in our best interest to do a little bit of this here. Since we are plenty far ahead of time on our Diplotech, or far enough ahead that I can justify taking it. Uh, besides, we need to embrace Renaissance before we take anything else. So, um, you know, I'd like to take Miltech eventually, but we'll see. We will see. Either way, so that will unlock that. And now, if I wanted to, I could pop my Golden Arrow, which would make it a lot cheaper to uh, take ideas and, uh, well, eventually take ideas and technology. Uh, but in order to do that, we need to take out some loans. So I'm looking at this, and I think it might be in a good position to go indebted to the burgers, and we are going to upgrade a couple of these guys here. Uh, namely, well, we need to not be at war for it, so that's kind of silly that I did that. But either way, um, we could embrace the institution, but I think I'll let it spread a little bit more. There's a couple provinces over here. So uh, regardless, what we are going to do here is we are just chilling. Now, as far as navally goes, they do have 12 galleys here. We have two heavies, but Norway's got three heavies. Hmm... Yeah, that's a lot of galleys right there. I think that would be foolish. Now, I do have some galleys being built, but uh, I think in the meantime, we just need to, you know, get down here and siege down some of that stuff. So I think we're good. I, I do think we are all right. But yeah, I hope that you guys are enjoying the run. If you are enjoying, please do make sure you let me know. Leave a like. I, I appreciate that quite a bit. All right. Now, their war exhaustion will be going up. Ticking war score is also going up. You can see here we're going to get a five more. And uh, if we can or annex their um, capital here, or occupy Norway's capital here, we should have enough war score to get basically whatever we want. Now, let's head over here and make sure we're picking up a general, of course. Our military engineer, huh? Well, that's fine with me. Let's go ahead and take a discipline guy, yeah? Fine by me. Discipline advisors are very strong. Let's get Jean Barreau over here. Now... Yeah, I, this is really fine. Um, they're, they're nowhere to be found. Their army is gone. Yeah, they got 10,000. These guys have three, and they're all right here. So, uh, yeah, I think we're good. I do think we're good. Now, we need to get some advisors over here. Uh, let's get a claim on Lancashire here. Recall you. And let's see here. Obviously, we're taking one, two, three, four, five. That's a lot. Uh, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 provinces in this peace deal. Uh, obviously, I would like to take as much as I can, so we are going to. Um, and then we also need to be working on getting some spy network built up over here so we can attack these guys. But as soon as we take this Akershus, we should be in a better position to uh, peace out. These guys are being very funny and they... They refuse to siege that province. As long as I'm sitting on their capital, uh, that might be it, baby. That might be it. Truce to some people is over. Doesn't matter. Our AE is super manageable. You can definitely feel those AE changes from 1.32. And uh, just like that, we get no coalition either. How about that? So if we take a look at this number here, we're up to 66 of the required 100. And we still have a little less than 40 years left. Um, it's pretty good. <laughs> that is pretty good. Uh, all right, cool. I will core all. Well, let's see here. Before I do that, I'm going to pop my golden arrow. So what we're going to do is upgrade every center of trade that we can. Uh, I need to take Bordeaux back. So we have that. Do I not have enough? Oh, I should have enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just need to upgrade a couple of these guys over here. So, right, let's upgrade you. I'm going to do a little bit of development so we can upgrade it. Right, it needs to be in a state. This isn't stated yet. I'm still coring some stuff. What's this about? Oh, Dumfries. Oh, well, that's fine. There we go. As soon as you core that up, at least partially state it. Don't have to full state it. Um, again, I will come on over here and I will increase the autonomy so as to not have to worry too much about any unrest. Looks like we might have some war exhaustion, so I'm going to let that tick down for a bit. So no biggie. 
little bit of unrest. Yeah. So I reckon it is from war exhaustion. Yeah, we have some war exhaustion. We have one stability, which is nice. So just like that, we are up to four. Now we need to upgrade one more center of trade. Now I don't have any. This is level two. Bordeaux I haven't taken yet. Oh, here it is. There you go. I need to click this button one time. And then on the monthly tick, we will be able to embrace the institution here. Or uh, not embrace the institution. Pop our golden era, which will make everything here 10% cheaper, which is going to save us quite a bit of mana in the long term. Uh, obviously, we want to embrace institution eventually as well. I'm going to let it... Mm, yeah, I'll let it spread to a few more. I mean, the, the longer we wait, it's fine. It, it doesn't hurt us to do it. Now, these guys here, we definitely need to... I have loans to repay. Ah, you cannot influence your subjects when you have loans. Good to know. Well, let's go ahead and um, keep improving our relations with our subjects down here. I'm going to in, uh, integrate these guys ASAP. It's fine, though. A little bit of time to chill is not an issue because we are waiting for our... Um, go ahead and it, take that as long as we can keep it at least you know close to 30 um we need to integrate our subjects that will give us uh one two three four five six more provinces which will get us over to 72 and um i, I promise you we're going to get a lot of land in this war coming up here with these guys so let's see here yeah i don't think this is really worth it anymore I guess we can collect up here instead of the North Sea. It might give us a little bit of extra money. 4.4 should go up to like 5 something maybe. No, it went down actually. Interesting. Hmm. Transfer from here maybe? 3.7. 4.4. So yeah. I think we just have to embrace the fact that we are going to be losing money for the rest of this, um, you know, big blue blob rush. Obviously, after we are done with that, we'll be in, in a much better spot. Like, we'll be able to chill, right? Right. Let's have our navy over here grouped up. Let's get an army over here in Bratsburg. Actually, let's have them head up to Trondelag. And we're going to need to get an army up here. So, yeah. <laughs> Just thinking about how I want to manage this. Let's have you guys brought over here. Have these guys will handle Sweden. And then these guys will also get brought up to handle uh, the English. That should be fine. Yeah. Governing capacity is starting to stack up a bit. Let's go ahead and click this button as well. It'll take us below the 20, but it's fine. I'm really not too upset about it. Now we are not the papal controller, which is less than ideal, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and rival da -da -da -da, England. Sounds good to me. Could get a little bit of extra pee, pee here if we send an insult, which uh, if you do not know, um, I will explain something here. Uh, so I only need really one claim. Yeah, I think one claim is fine. What you can do is if you have at least 50 pee, pee every month, you will gain plus one of each type of mana point, monarch point right here. So one extra admin, diplo, and mill mana per month. Oh, did I not scornfully insult them? I did. Nani? Oh, there you go. That was weird. It like had a delay update. Did you guys see that too? All right. Either way, we are fine. Now, embracing institution is something I want to do ASAP. I will extend the monopoly, not because it's good, but because I need the money. Now, I am partially stated up here. Did I full core that stuff? I did, didn't I? Oh, I'm such a fool. That's okay. It's fine. It's fine. I did not mean to do that, but that's it's whatever. I'll let the autonomy go down a bit, I guess. <laughs> Over time, eventually. All right, let's get you guys up here. Now, we are going to need to handle them. 116 stack against Norway or Sweden should be good. Now... These guys have forts over here. They got uh, fully maintained, fully maintained. Okay, so... Yeah, we're going to have to rush them down. Now, I'm not going to... Oh, Sweden won't help them, actually. This might be my move. I am actually going to do this instead. Now, how are you guys doing? They still don't have an heir. You know what? Screw it. Let's get, um, get started on integrating... Well, first of all, I want to integrate these guys first. Mm-hmm. There's nothing I can do except for just wait 
All right. I guess we will begin the integration process of these lads instead then. I just need to free up some diplomats. That's why diplomatic ideas sound so good to me. Let's get a couple more claims up here then. Uh, if, well, god dang it. All right. If um, we can call in Burgundy and Castile, that's fine. My subjects, or at least uh, Orléans, will handle this over here. Castile will hand help over there. Let's go for dun, 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 Cumbria. Sweden will join now. What? Okay. Oh, this game is so wacky. All right. So Sweden will not join. Which means they should have just broken their alliance. Yes, they did. And now you call in your allies because the game is weird like that. <laughs> but Sweden is gone. Dun, 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 dun. Now, I do need to be mindful because they probably have some heavy ships. They have eight. Six heavy ships. All right. So, yeah, doesn't look like we're going to be able to do much with this. Now, I will actually put these guys on defensiveness over here because they'll have to siege down Dumfries, I believe, if they want to get into Ireland. I think they might be able to just march up north into... Um, I definitely don't need this fort anymore. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. No need to pay for it. Okay. Let's have you guys head over here with a general. Siege down that fort. Very good. Let's have you guys come on up here. If this is the case, I can probably spare some of these guys. Now, in this war, I'm going to take at least, you know, the, the cheap stuff. Like, over here, man. Yeah, something like this is good. A lot of AE, but again, nobody can really join it. I, I'm not really too flustered about it. Now, I'm checking these guys every once in a while just to see who is getting excommunicated. It doesn't really look like we're going to get lucky with the... Oh, Brittany joined. Oh, shoot. I didn't even see that. Right, right, right. That's uh, less than ideal. Looks like Portugal's about to get absolutely clobbered down here. Is that a wipe? No, but they definitely lost a lot of men. Look at the numbers, man. The numbers, Mason. What do they mean? I'm hitting the wrong button here. There you go. All right. <laughs> so how do we want to do this? I do need to be mindful that the British Navy could very easily catch me and clap my cheeks. Though, it looks like that's the way to do it there. And we do have our light ships here. This eight stack will be useful. We'll siege down these guys. Hopefully, my subjects will prevent my inter my hinterlands from getting sieged down. I think I will bring over this other eight stack. So, let's have you guys over here. Are we having a lot of unrest over here? Yeah, we are kind of having a lot of unrest over here. Are we going to have rebels, though? Norwegian separatists. Yeah. Um... Okay, well, hopefully, so they got the Burgundian, or the, uh, what is this called? The Iberian Wedding. So hopefully Aragon, let's see if I can say, hey, Aragon, you want to come up here? See these guys down, and let's say Burgundy, come on over here then. Should be fine, should be fine. Um, I don't really want to risk bringing my navy out just in case. Those eight heavy ships are kind of terrifying, I'm not going to lie. All right, these guys are sieging down Calais. I will happily give Brittany Calais. I guess we can lose a little bit of money. That is fine. So these guys are sieging them down now. All right, Castile, lay the smack down, baby. There you go. They're tracking down those guys. Okay, it looks like we are in a good spot then. I will continue to get claims on these lads over here. Uh, What is the button there? What the heck? XC. Yes. There we go. The more claims we get, the better. They are only allied to Mecklenburg, so this is actually the perfect opportunity for us. I'm going to take... I'm going to separate piece Leinster out for that province as well. Leinster, however it's pronounced. I always get corrected about the um, <laughs> the uh, Irish pronunciations. Like, bro, I could not care less. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I love you, Irish boys, but I could not care less. We have a Queen Regency, huh? Luckily, she is a 532, so that's pretty solid. She's a 22, so she's nice and young. So young Louis will have a uh, solid regency. Land leader shock is also quite good, so I can live with that. Come on, 21. Hey, 21. Let's give that to Orléans. Where are you guys at? 32k. Yikes. That's uh, statistically significant. All right. Let's have these guys parked over here. I will annex you. You don't get a say, my friend. England's got some men in the field now. Now, 
these guys are over here putting that smack down on Portugal. Now, I don't really care about Portugal. The sooner I piece them out, the better, uh, because it will allow us... To, oh, all right. I can also reconquer these provinces here. So rather than taking like these guys here, I'll retake those, of course. That will be less AE as well. All right, this is perfect. So I'm waiting for these guys to lock in. Mein Gott. Uh, I don't care about Fa's opinion of me. Let's go ahead. These guys are going to be slow to reinforce because we scorched the province, so they won't be there till the 24th. So, yep, they won't even reinforce. Beautiful. What are you guys going to do now, huh? I mean, I'll take that. That is a 2 to 1. I will happily, happily take those numbers, even if it is a minus 1. Look at those losses. Not sustainable for them. Safe to say. Safe to say. Uh, Linster, you will be annexed. 7 AE is reasonable. Nobody cares about us annexing the Irish. Sag. All right. This is Scorch, so it's like we, we really are okay. Let's not take too much attrition. Uh, no, I would rather not lose an... Oh, come on, man. Yeah, I'd rather not. Let's see here. So there's some boys down in Kent. How's the naval stuff looking? Oh, shoot. Yeah, Burgundy's vassals got absolutely clapped, which is no fun. Oh, they're back. <laughs> Honey, I'm home. There you go. Let's scorch this up. Let's uh, head on in like a baby. And uh, clap these guys. They're taking a minus one. Jean Barreau, man. Absolute legend. I didn't even look at those numbers. I should have seen the uh, the losses they're taking. They had 32,000, so now they're down to 18. How much manpower do they have? 11,000. Ah. 10% AE impact reduction is juicy. Juicy. Oh, no coalition. <laughs> oh, you'll love to see it, folks. Now, obviously, we're going to have to siege down London and whatnot. Uh, we will separate piece out Portugal, and we will separate piece out Brittany. Um, I will have these guys break their alliances. These guys can probably stay. That's fine. Um, obviously, if I can full annex them, I eventually will. There is a decent bit of development over here in Brittany, so... You have to be mindful of that. The AE from Brittany is not insignificant. Now, I'm just trying to be a little mindful of this. If I don't have to lose a ton of men from getting caught out in a in a battle, I'd rather not. They have E, huh? Interesting. Wait a minute. They excommunicated... Who? Who did they excommunicate? I missed it. Son of a gun. Who did they excommunicate? Florence. Okay. That's not useful for us, sadly. There's another 20 stack coming over here. Yeah, you guys want to do that? That's fine with me. So this is farmlands. I don't know if I actually want to take that fight, but I will. Because I'm a mad lad. We've got the cavalry. Look at those. Oh, those losses are actually quite even. Feels bad. Must have rolled pretty badly. I wasn't paying attention there. We did take a minus one crossing the river there. But, uh, yeah, we can afford manpower losses. They cannot. Inventory is woods. Oh, yeah. How about a stack wipe instead? That's pretty smooth. Hey. Shift consolidate. Come in here. We outnumber them almost two to one this time around as well. So we are going to be flanking the crap out of them. Here we go. All right. Very good. Portugal is almost there. All righty then. So you guys are honestly okay to get white pieced. Just break off your alliance with England. That is so reasonable. That will free up my subjects to come on over here and handle them as well. Oh, a missed opportunity, bro. My bad. I might have been able to stack wipe them if I was paying attention. Sadly, no such luck this time. But this little two stack here is gone, reduced to atoms. Now we have to go down and siege down Londinium. All is well with that. Now they've lost 40. That is crazy. Holland alone has lost 13 ships. What the heck, bro? You guys suck. <laughs> All right, let's embrace this institution. Take this technology. Um, I will upgrade my infantry. I think it is fine. They don't have an army now, so they're not going to be able to attack me. They will not feel brave enough to do it. Let's, um... Maybe I should, um focus on getting them wiped down. Now, my morale is not that good here. Alright, does not matter. 
Yeah, these guys are... Okay, I lied. We're going to uh, carpet siege them down a bit. War exhaustion is pretty high. It's reasonable. We can handle this. Uh, these guys, again, break off their alliance with England. Yeah, that's, uh, that's it. Now, obviously, we'll break off their alliance, but I'll also take war reps. We're going to need money and 20-some uh, ducats from, from them. Sounds good. Calais is occupied. I do have to give... I am going to give them Calais. There's no reason not to. Um, I don't think that's going to allow me to take Northumberland, though. I would like to take Northumberland in the war, but we'll see. We'll see exactly what we're capable of here. Now, how are you guys doing? 7k. We will surround London. If they want to come up and send their stack up here to start sieging stuff back, that's fine. It's, it's not going to hurt us. All right, let's make sure we are continuing to core everything. And we are getting close to taking this tech for getting that Diplo, which will be very nice. Looks like we're not going to get province war score cost anything, so <laughs> that's okay, though. All right, if they want to come up here and siege this stuff down while I siege down their capital, be my guest. Be my guest. I will make sure we take Diplo tech to stay ahead of time for that extra uh, trade efficiency, because it will help out our economy quite heavily. We are actually quite close to this. This is great. 51 AE. So reasonable, man. Could take Cornwall. It wouldn't be touching borders with a lot of this other stuff. York is a center of trade. So is this Gloucester. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, these guys are done. They're, uh, they're done. We can speed five the rest of this war, I reckon. All we need to do is siege down London. And we will be good with this. Now, where are we at numbers-wise? We're at 69. Nice. So we have 68, because Sayuda doesn't count. Um, this war will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, maybe 11, if I want to take, like, Cornwall. I think I might just take war reps instead, though, if I'm going to 100% them. The money is going to be useful. I mean, obviously, we have debt. We have a lot of debt. I'm not afraid of debt. It's not something that scares me. I may even be able to take more debt. Yeah can't do this sadly oh you can't revoke it really is that true i thought you could revoke it and then retake the loans interesting i did not know that's how that worked yikes all right um there's six ships there all right yeah we just need to siege down london that's the big one there I'm going to continue to push for Papal Controller. Now, these guys should be... Yikes, man. They got good defensiveness over here. Let's make sure we are keeping our claims up over here. They're probably going to win that siege, aren't they? Man, you wonder why people don't... People gripe about this game. State needs the money or prestige. I will definitely take the money. That's fine with me. Yeah, you guys are clowns. Clowns, clowns, clowns. clowns. Get out of here. You suck and I hate you. Get bent, mate. Oh, that's a stack wipe, too. Nice. We got rebels popping. Where? All right, this is fine. Uh, I do need to get a couple more men in the field. That's fine. We've got some force limit down here, so let's go ahead and get those. Five more is totally fine with me. They're they're on a siege, uh, a fort rather, so that is fine. Now we just need to win London. Once we win London, they will be uh, significantly less likely to um to resist us. There you go. Come on now. Come on now. 42. 42. Come on now. 42. 42. <laughs> POV. You are playing a uh, base race. 42. Faceting. There you go. Here you go. Okay, we can actually piece them out now. So... Somehow, something went up in war score. I don't know why. So I guess we'll just take the money then. That's fine. That is wonderful. Right. All right, cool. So let's have you guys head over here with Jean Barreau. He's like my one general that has been just duking it out. Reconquer Gascony. Claims on Provence, which is fine. 100 years war. And we get claims on some land around us, which is great. Plus one stability, which is awesome. 
Can I boost that? No, sadly. But we do get some admin mana, which is great. We could definitely use that. Uh, obviously, we need to core this all up. And uh, life's good. So, that puts us up to 78. So that just means we need, what, 78? That's uh, 22 more provinces in 30 years? I think we can do that, right? We just need to take land from these guys. Obviously, if we can attack these guys, we will. I'm really, I would really like it if these guys would, if he would die, that would be like best case scenario. Let's make sure we royal marry him. We can annex these guys, which I will do. We can annex these guys, which I will do. I just need to get their relations up. <laughs> I keep on uh, letting it sag down. So we need to improve relations with these guys. Get a couple more claims on uh, these lads over here. This is fine. This is fine. All right, cool. Well, so far so good. I would say Big, Big Blue Blob is essentially in the bag. We just need to wrap up some stuff with Sweden, maybe get into Muscovy. I don't think that would be too hard. They have 40,000 men, but, um, you know, AI and all that. So if you guys are enjoying and you want to see more, make sure you let me know. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe for more. Ding the bell. Join the Discord. The subreddit, the Twitter, all those things are linked in the description. And if you want to check out my second channel, Chubert, you can check it out linked in the description. And if you want to support me on Patreon, you get early access to Chubert bids. But uh, that's all I got for you for today. This is Chewy Shoot, and I will catch you guys later.